In this video, we're going to look at some more examples of subtracting mixed numbers. So you remember from our previous uh, video, what we do is subtract the whole numbers. So 4 take away 2, which is going to be 2. And we subtract the fractions, quarter take away half. So quarter take away half, we've got to get a common denominator. The common denominator of a quarter and a half is 4. So the first fraction doesn't need to change. The second fraction, well, I've multiplied the bottom by uh, 2, so I need times the top by 2, so I'm going to get 2. Quarter take away uh, 2 quarters is going to be minus a quarter. Okay. So what am I left with? Well, I'm left with 2, and I'm left with minus a quarter. So 2 take away quarter. Well, that's not finished. I can't have the minus sign there. So what I need to do is split this 2 into a whole, and with a second hole, I'm going to change into quarters. Well, there are four quarters in a hole. So I put that down, take away my quarter. So I'm going to have one hole, and four quarters take away one quarter is three quarters. So my answer is one and three quarters. Let's look at the second example. So I take away my whole numbers. So five take away two is three. Then I take away my um, fractions. Two fifths minus three quarters. Now... Um, I need to find my uh, lowest common denominator. The lowest common denominator of 5 and 4 is 20. So put that in there. Now, I, I've multiplied 5 to get 20 by 4, so I must multiply the top by 4, so 2 times 4 is 8. And to get from 4 to 20 on this side, I've multiplied by 5, so I must multiply the 3 by 5, so 3 by 5 is 15. 8 20 is minus 15 20 is, well... Uh, obviously, I have 20 on the bottom. 8 take away 15 is negative 7. So, taking these two things together, what I've got is 3 take away 7 twentieths. So, now, now I'm going to split up that 3, because I can't leave it like that, into two holes and change the last of the holes into twentieths. Well, there are 20 twentieths in a hole, and the top must be the same as the bottom, if it's equivalent to a hole, and then take away my 7 twentieths. So, I've got my two holes. 20 20ths take away 7 20ths is 13 20ths, and there's my answer.